its energy surrounds us and binds us. What is up, Star Wars fans, and welcome back to another reaction here on Carbonite Convos. We can't thank you guys enough for joining us for episode two of Andor. Now, we did release our episode one reaction on the night it came out, uh, but we unfortunately weren't able to do episode two and three, so those are coming at you right now. We're going to do two first, obviously, and then three will be out right afterwards. So thank you guys for joining us, and I am super excited to get into episode two. Alec, what about you? Say, man, you know, you kind of said it yourself better late than never. I will say it is nice to be doing this during daylight hours, uh, yes. but I'm ready to roll. I'm ready to see what Andor is going to offer us today. So let's get into it. Definitely. I think the only time we've ever done daylight reactions are like the trailers. Iron Groot ones and then trailers. So yeah. it's nice to be able to just watch an episode and not almost fall asleep through them. So we are going to hit play in three, two, uno. This intro is dope. Keep forgetting that it's the intro. I know. I'm kind of like, what the hell are those? Like, you notice the lines on the A and the R look like the saber things on this like Inquisitor ship we saw in the trailer. I don't know if that's on purpose or not. It looks like Ray's staff a little bit. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Wow. Mining, maybe? Has to be. Yeah. This was the part from the trailer. Like the extended cut thing? No, just the, the first trailer that ever came out. Oh. That dude ringing that bell was part of the trailer for sure. Well, with trailers, they take bits and pieces from everywhere, so... Wrong, little piggy. Oh, wow. That's the lady from the this strip club. Oh. That's who was looking for someone from Canary. Yeah, that's... Wow. Pass along the kind words to the chief inspector. He gives me the same kind of vibe as Hux. Who? Oh, the one? this This one right here with the black hair. Yeah. Imperial. That was at the end of the last episode, right? I don't know. I think it was. Because we asked like, Vader. Like. I like his blaster. Did you, did you see her suit? It looked like a rebel pilot suit, but it wasn't. That it does one, look like that a one right pilot suit. Yeah. I mean, you never know. It might be. Wait, no, that was that was it, stupid. It doesn't was stupid. really exist yet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's why I was like, right when I said it, I was like, nope. Nope. Is that the ship? Oh, no. this is the guy. This is the guy. The guy who's going to recruit uh, Oh, Cassian. okay. Zelvig, right? Yeah, Zelvig, yeah. I think that's the like lightsaber ship. Oh. I don't know. I think so. It looks like it. We only got a glimpse. Just curious why you think they picked that scene to show. What scene? In the extended cut. I'm just I curious. Think it's you think it's going to be prevalent? Like super prevalent? Well, that was him recruiting Cassian for the rebellion. Mm. And it. I think that's the best description of the early rebellion we'll ever see. True that. I, I don't know that it, it hit deep with both of us. Mm -hmm. So I think they knew that for a reason. Watch sports center. <laughs> Do you think they have the equivalent of that? Probably we've see, kind of seen it like attack of the clones. Yeah. It was just sports yeah. on, but it looked like the same kind of setup. Uh, you can only use the errands excuse so many times. Look at that little bantha. <laughs> I like it. That's neat. Oh, oh that's wow. his. Yeah, she's recognizing it. Dope. 
Is that a person laying there? I think so. Not a trooper. No. Not. Doesn't look human either. They look very yellow. Yellow. See that logo though? What logo is that? I can't tell. Can't remember what logo that was. It was over on the right arm, right? Up. Oh. oh shit. I knew she was gonna die, man. Well, he is human. Maybe it's just like the air or something. I don't know. And that's where the hate starts. That's an interesting wow. show. Wow. He looks scared. I'm saying he gives me the same vibe as Hux. Like where he puts on this front of being like a badass. Yeah, but he's actually not. <laughs> Someone made a good point. They were like, his speech right there is almost the exact opposite of Jin's when they're going to Scarif. Right it's not exactly, but it's it's interesting. It is interesting. Does he know he's going to look for Cassian? What I assume is what Cassian has is so hard to find or so hard to acquire that he needs to get he needs to find the person that has it, regardless of who they are. So, no, I don't think he's looking for Cassian specifically. He's looking for the but device. But he's looking for... Well, no, he's looking for the device, yes. But he's looking to recruit whoever was able to get the device. Interesting. Regardless of if that's Cassian or... So, whoever it may be. Or, yeah. or Anakin or Spider-Man, whoever it is. That's joking. Whoever it is. Spider-Man fought for the Rebellion? be over be um, whoever it is um i think it's just so hard to find that he needs to recruit whoever had the the talent or whatever whatever skill set needed to get it interesting i like that take yeah i like that episode i think I we're going too. i think we're go it, it, it is a slower show you know it not was a, one a of those of ones and we've had them before where we were like not talking too much because we were really trying to take in there was a lot of talking in the show yeah and there's a lot of story yeah exactly so we're getting set up and we're getting set up quick it's 12 episodes right yeah hell yeah that's that's and sweet season one there's two seasons both 12 episodes and that's it nice that's it uh but yeah i really liked this episode um i think we're good to go to move on to episode three if you are yes sir all right, let's hit it. Um, everybody, we can't thank you enough for tuning into episode two of Andor. Like we just said, we're about to hop on episode three. So we hope to see you there. But if not, until the next time you're on Carbonite Combos, like always, may the force be with you. Remember, the force will be with you. Always. Always.